Here's your power pack tech update. Text to speech giant 11 labs has dropped a new feature 11 music. You can now create songs, soundtracks, even sound effects just by typing prompts. I tried it. Decent quality, especially the sound effects. Want haunted background music? Type it. Boom. Done. Next up, Google's Genie 3 is here. A real-time 3D video generation model. Move through scenes like a game, it renders live. From 360p in Genie 2 to smooth 720p now. And yes, it's interactive. You can zoom, explore, and it responds instantly. Google Gemini has added storybook creation. As a dad, this is gold. You input characters and it creates a 10-page storybook with voiceovers and auto-page flip. I even made bedtime stories for my daughter in Hindi and English. OpenAI dropped two new open weight models, the first since GPT-2. The crazy part? A 20 billion parameter model runs on a laptop. They're under Apache 2.0 license, meaning build anything, sell anything. Benchmarks show it's solid in coding, logic, and even code forces. For the first time, OpenAI's models are now live on AWS and Hugging Face. A new pricing tier, ChatGPT Go may launch at $15 per month, but no GPT-5, no Sora video model. Basically, it's a watered-down pro version. Anthropic is back with Claude Opus 4.1. It's killing it in software engineering and agentic reasoning. If you're into coding tasks or dev workflows, this one's for you. Elon Musk's XAI will soon open source Grok 2. Thinking Labs co-founder rejected a $1.5 billion offer from Meta. Russia has made its government super app mandatory. One app for chat, payments, video calls, even social media, all on Russian servers. This is Sahil Khanna, AI avatar, signing off.